Hello students, welcome back. The topic that we are going to learn today is median. So let's get started. First of all, median is the middle value of an arranged data which divides the data into two equal parts. Now the thing out here is that the data should be arranged. All right. So median is the middle value of an arranged data. Okay. So before moving on, let's look at the formulas first. That what are the formulas? for all types of data that is group, ungroup and frequency distribution to calculate median. Okay, so the formula for group data okay, is median equals to L plus H upon F summation F by F summation F by 2 minus CF. Now the symbolic representation of median is this. This is the symbolical representation of median. Now L represents the lower boundary of median class. All right, and H is the height or width of median group. Now since we are dealing with equal number of classes, so the height is same for all the classes. But when it happens when unequal classes are given, so we take a, a height of median group only. Okay, summation F represents the total frequency, whereas CF represents the cumulative frequency preceding to median class. Now, in this uh, group data, we are not going to take cumulative frequency of the median group, but we are going to take cumulative frequency preceding to median class. Alright, so this is one of the important things. Now, as you can see that I am already saying median class, the first thing is that we need to determine what is my median class all right so for that we're going to use this part of the formula that is summation f by 2 summation f by 2 will help you find out what is your median class okay so this formula through this formula we will uh, understand that what exactly my median class is okay the second is ungrouped data now so median for ungroup is n plus 1 divided by 2 now it says value that it, it actually tells you the position of median okay so for ungrouped data what happen is that this formula will not going to give you the final answer it will tell you the position where exactly your median value is and then we'll go back to the data and find out a median so this is important when position is required or you can say that for median for ungrouped data we need to find out the position value first then only we can solve uh, we can find out what median is so n out here actually represents the number of observations now moving on for median for simple frequency distribution for simple frequency distribution as you can see the formula just looks like the formula for ungroup but the only difference is that in ungroup data it was n plus 1 in simple frequency distribution it is summation f plus 1 divided by 2 all right the so simple frequency means uh, it's actually a tabular form which is in which observations are listed and with each observation its corresponding frequency is mentioned all right okay so summation f represents the total frequency so moving on, we are now going to start solving question for uh, ungrouped data first. Now, ungrouped data basically has two cases. Okay, so first case is when the number of observations are odd. Now what happens if you are given a question to solve, you are given a question to in which you are asked to find out median and uh, the number of observations that are given to you are odd. Okay, so this is the data we need to find out median of this data okay now the first and very important thing is that we need to arrange this data so the first step of finding median is you need to arrange the data first all right and we are ascending in ascending order we are going to array the data in ascending order and this is how the data looks like after arranging it now you can see 2 comma 2 from the uh, uh, from this least value that is 2 from the higher value till the higher highest value that is 31 
okay so 2 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 now 7 appears 7 times 3 times 7 appear 3 times in the data so 7 comma 7 comma 7 comma 9 comma 11 comma 18 comma 31 so that is how the data is arranged now now since n is 11 as you can count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 the number of observations given to you are 11 okay now the second part is the formulation part now we use the formula n plus 1 divided by 2 so 11 plus 1 divided by 2 now it gives you sixth value as I told you that this formula will going to give you the position value all right so you're gonna go back towards the data now this is the data and we're gonna look at sixth value the sixth position what sixth position is what's the value written at sixth position so one two three four five six now at sixth position the value written is seven so my median is equals to seven the first thing what we are going to do when median is asked for an ungrouped data we are going to arrange it then we are going to use formula from that formula we are going to find out the position and then we are going to look that position into our data and find out our exact answer. So it is very important in median that you arrange the data first. If in case you forget or you didn't arrange the data all right so the answer will not be correct and because you know it come the numbers are here in order and as it says that median is always the middle value of an arranged data if your data is not arranged you cannot find out the median so the first and important condition is that you need to array the data first then you're going to use the formula to find out the position at which your median is and then we're going to look at that position and define after that we're going to write down our answer that this position value is this and a median value is this so in this case the median is 7 all right so moving on we're moving now moving on towards when the case for case 2 when number of observations are even okay so find median of the following data this is the data given to me all right as I told you the first step is that we need to arrange the data so this is the arrangement of data in ascending order we have added the data in ascending order all right the least value was 27 uh, and the highest value is 55 so 27 29 32 36 38 39 41 42 43 and 5 now you can count that the number of observations given out here are even 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 so the number of observations are 10 now the second step formulation we're going to use the formula to look for the position so 10 plus 1 divided by 2 after solving it okay now it gives me the value that your median is at 5.5th value now if such thing appears okay and you need to find out position for 5.5th position okay so how you're going to do it see what we're going to do is we're going to round this value before before and after so this value will be 5 plus 6 okay so we're gonna add these two position values and we're gonna divide it by 2 now first of all this is my data as I told you that we're gonna round this value before and after that is 5.5 means fifth plus sixth value okay divided by 2 now in this case fifth value is 1 2 3 4 5 so fifth value is 38 and sixth value is 39 all right and the median lies in between so fifth plus sixth value divided by 2 so 38 plus 39 divided by 2 gives me 38.5 so my median value is 38.5 um, it happens only in median okay that whenever the answer will the position specifically will be like 5.5 6.5 7.5 the half position right because you're dividing that data you the formula is that you divide it by two that is the half the half value all right so 
if 6.5 let's say the value is 6.5 value you have you are asked so 6.5 means sixth value plus seventh value divided by 2 let's say it's 7.5 so that means seventh value plus eight value divided by two so that is how you calculate uh, median when number of observations given to you are odd or uh, sorry when the number of observations are given to you even in earlier we saw odd and uh, in this case we saw how to solve uh, or how to find out median when number of observations are, are even i hope that you have now understood that uh, that how to calculate median for both ungrouped cases that is when number of observation is odd and even and do remember that the first thing is that we need to array the data first so this is the first step for calculating median for ungrouped array the data use the formula find out the position and look for the po look for that position then declare your answer all right hope you have understood that thank you so much